you know, when we find a campground and we're selling in, isn't it nice when you find something like this along a, a beautiful stream? Maybe you have your fishing pole along, you catch yourself a trout for dinner. But more often than not, we just don't end up in beautiful places like this. But sometimes where we end up is not really as nice as this at all. We end up by railroad tracks where there's no sound of a bubbling brook, but of trains passing by. Loud trains, loud trains. And in the middle of the night when you're trying to sleep, that is no fun at all. So here's my tip for today. When you make a reservation at an RV park, do this first. Call and ask whoever answers if there's railroad tracks next to the park. Don't rely on a directory like this. They will not tell you if they're located next to a railroad track on the approach to a major airport or next to a busy freeway. But if you've ever camped near a railroad track, you know that it is very hard at night to sleep from the loud noise and the earth shaking. You do not want to have your campfire fanned at night by the wind from passing trains. So ask if there are railroad tracks close to the park. And if there's nobody to ask, then go to Google Maps or go to Google Earth and look at the satellite view and you will see tracks if they are there, like in this photo. You can see that these people are camped right up against a railroad track. I have been there. I pulled into an RV park once. Beautiful, peaceful looking place. I backed in up to a row of hedges. It seemed perfect. And then a train went by. It was no more than 25 feet away. And through the night, it woke me up repeatedly, and when I was half asleep, I was sure that a train was going to derail. You can imagine how much sleep I got. So my tip of the day is always call an RV park before making a reservation and find out if it's near railroad tracks.